Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of Yakuza 0. This is your boy Kadako Gaming, and you know how we do things around here. Let's see. Hey baby, looking for a good time? Uh, better not be you saying that. I think we have to act the hero real quick before we start this episode for realsies. What the hell? Is it on the other side of the building? I think it is. Ain't nobody got time for this. God damn it. Let's just talk to this guy. We have another sub story to start and finish. Hey there. You want some mushrooms? Huh? Mushrooms? <laughs> I got some great ones. Guaranteed to put a smile on your face. What do you say? Mushrooms that will put a smile on my face? My face? Sorry, I'm not interested in smiling. Come on. Why not give them a try, at least? You won't find finer mushrooms anyway. Yeah. No, I'm good. Go and ask someone else. <sighs> I see. That's too bad, isn't it? Hey, you. Is it true that you're selling mushrooms here? Uh, a customer. What kind of mushrooms are you looking for, Mike? Mm. Um, I've never done them before. I don't know much. Can you get me the green purple? <laughs> Haha, <laughs> it's rare to find someone new to shrooms. All the ones I stuck are great, but let me think. How about enoki mushrooms? They're in season now. Enoki? Enoki? <laughs> I get it. You give them regular names so nobody catches on, huh? Smart. Huh? But enoki is enoki, you know? You can't make enoki without... What do you mean? I'm looking for the kind of mushrooms that will make me feel good. Well, my enoki mushrooms are top quality. Eat them in a hot pot and you feel alright. Huh? Are you making fun of me because it's my first time? You want your face rearranged? No, I'm not making fun of you, mate. I don't want my face rearranged. Wait, this mushroom dealer. Oi. Hey, that's enough. I get the feeling this guy's not the kind of mushroom dealer you're looking for. Huh? I don't get it. And who asked you anyway? Fuck off. Wait, wait. Hear me out before you get your face rearranged. If you're not gonna shut your mouth, I'll shut it for ya. Oh shit! I didn't even see the pump. <laughs> oh, what the fuck was that? This guy's ridiculous! Um, thanks for helping me, Mike. Yeah. Well, I was just defending myself. No, you're a lifesaver. Can I ask you your name? It's Kiryu. <laughs> Kiryu son, huh? Yeah, might. Take this as my thanks. You got an Enokitake. So you really do sell regular mushrooms, huh? <sighs> That's what I said from the beginning, mate. My mushrooms are guaranteed to put a smile on your face. Mm. That's exactly the kind of talk that confuses people. Look, you know there are mushrooms that make you hallucinate when you eat them, right? If you sell mushrooms in a shady part of town like Kamarucho, people are bound to get mixed up. Why don't you sell them elsewhere? Hmm, mm, it's just... Mm. What? Nani ga nani? Is there some reason it has to be Kamarucho? I want as many people as possible to enjoy my mushrooms, mate. Tokyo is the best place to find lots of people. Kamarucho especially. Well, you're not wrong about that. I've only just started out. But if I pack up and leave now, it'll feel like I failed, you know? I want to give it a little bit more time. I see. Well, 
I won't stop you. Be careful though. <laughs> You're a kind man, Kiryu son. Thanks. They call me Kitajima the Shroom. For magnificent mushrooms, Kitajima's your man. See you around then, fam. Hey up. So Oh kill your son. I've got some great mushrooms in stock, mate. You want some? Hook me up with one of them shiitakes, dog. <laughs> oh, hello. Okay. Uh. All right then. Uh, we are just gonna keep purchasing mushrooms until we max out his. <laughs> All right. Uh. Well, I'll see you guys in a little bit. <laughs> He's really trying his best. Where the fuck did he go? I was trying to buy more mushrooms, mate. What the fuck is going on? Oi. This is just plain old shiitake mushroom. You got a death wish, punk? N no, of course not, mate. Mm. That's Kitajima the shroomer. Hurry up and hand over the shrooms. We want to get this train rolling. You screw us over, and we're gonna have to teach you a lesson. L look, mate. Like I said before, I only sell regular mushrooms. Uh? What? You expect us to believe you're here in the middle of Kamarucho selling nothing but table mushrooms in the middle of the fucking night? Oh, hmm. uh, looks like he just got himself into a mess there. Not that I'm surprised. Oi. Kill your son. Huh? What's your beef? This guy is really just a regular mushroom seller. If you want the other kind of mushroom, better try elsewhere. Oi. And who asked for your opinion, huh? You got some nerve butting in like that. You're gonna You're gonna regret disrespecting the boss. We just wanna trip out on shrooms, man. You're gonna be real sorry if you get in our way. <laughs> That's so. If it's a trip you want, I've got a one-way ticket to Pound Town with your name on it. Cocky fucker, you're going down. All right. So let me just a up. Uh -oh. Ooh. Fuck off. <laughs> this guy's a monster. Let's regroup, boss. You get what's coming to you. Oh, thanks for helping me again, mate. That was pretty dicey. Hmm. Yeah, I guess people still haven't gotten the message and I'm just selling regular mushrooms, man. Hmm. Oh, you couldn't have picked the worst place to sell him. Well, you have a point. But I don't think that's the only problem, you see. You don't? Pretty much every day someone comes here with the wrong idea, so there's got to be some other reason. The reason he gets mistaken for an illicit shroom dealer. Maybe it's your face? Maybe your face is the problem. Hmm? My face, mate! Uh. Yeah, that surly look on your face doesn't do you any favors. <sighs> but I can't help that. It's not like I can swap faces or anything. You have a point. The reason he gets mistaken for an illicit shroom dealer, I need to make it something he can try to fix. 
Maybe the way you talk is the problem. The way I talk? Uh. Yeah, that's it. You sound shady as hell. Just the type who would be selling dangerous mushrooms. Huh? You mumble a lot. And the way your sentences trail off doesn't help either. You have to be more cheerful in the service industry. But this is just how I talk, mate. Well, first you need to practice. Try being more cheerful when you speak. I've got good mushrooms. I've got good mushrooms. Like that. Not even close. Oh. You need to put more effort into it. Project your voice. Say it with your chest, little motherfucker. A smile is important too. Okay, okay. The finest mushrooms fresh today. My mushrooms are truly superb. <laughs> Much better. You still have a ways to go, but you're on the right track. That smile looks more natural, and it's a big improvement over your first attempt. <sighs> you really think so, Mike? I can't tell the difference, mate. Uh. I do. I bet fewer people will mistake you for a shady mushroom dealer now. <laughs> I hope so. Thank you, Kyu san You might want to change your laugh, too. Oh, Kyu san are you in the market for some marvelous mushrooms, mate? Alright, let's see if this still works. Yes, it does. I'll see you guys in a little sec. <laughs> He's speaking up a lot better now. All right. Oh, it's th th three people now. Three people. Let's go. <gasps> These are just my talking mushrooms. What are you trying to pull? <sighs> I don't sell any illicit mushrooms here, my. Mm. That's Kitajima the Shroomer. Say what? You gotta be kidding. Hand over the good mushrooms, quick. What the fuck are you, the Riddler? If you wanna stay in one piece, you better give us the real stuff before we get real annoyed. But like I said, mate, I only sell regular mushrooms. You think we're gonna believe you would set up shop in the middle of Kamarucho in the middle of the night selling plain old fucking mushrooms? Oh. Looks like I'm gonna get dragged into this mess again. Let's get it done. Oi. Kill your son! Who the fuck are you? This guy's just a regular mushroom seller. If you're looking for the other kind of mushroom, try somewhere else. Where do you get off talking to us like that? Is that a fucking riddle, man? Get out of the way, man! Uh? You get out of the way, man! You're obstructing his business! Uh? That does it. That does it. Let's smash this asshole. All right. Y'all got knives and shit. I'm out. a riddle for you, mate. Ooh. How did this kid get so fucking tough? Let's get the hell out of here, sir. You're gonna get it. 
Curious son, thank you for saving me yet again, mate. <sighs> you were in a bit of a bind. <sighs> I get the feeling there are still too many people who don't realize I'm a regular mushroom seller, mate. Mm. Yeah, you've gotten a lot friendlier, but this spot is a terrible place to sh sell mushrooms. Mm. Well, that may be true, but I'm sure there is room for improvement. Nani? Room for improvement? I don't want to blame it all on the location. If there are still things I can try, I'm going to stick with it. Let's see... What else can Kitajima do to stop people from thinking he's selling hallucinogenic mushrooms? A mascot, maybe? No. Hmm, a mascot. How about you design a mascot? A mascot? A person or character that represents your product. They're always using that kind of stuff in advertising. Hmm. Yeah, you're right. But well, who's going to be the mascot, mate? Good point. Hmm? How about me? What the fuck? Um, uh, I don't think so, mate. Okay, then. I thought I'd make a good mascot. But he doesn't agree. There must be something else he can do, though. How about doing some image training? Image training? Uh. Yeah, you just picture things in bed before you sleep. You could picture a normal... What the fuck are you talking about, Kiryu? You could picture normal customers coming the next day. And that actually works, yeah? Mm. Uh, no. Probably not. <sighs> oh, I didn't think so. Mm. Image training probably applies more to athletes. There must be something else you can try, though. A theme song. Mm. How about you come up with a theme song? Mm -hmm. A theme song, Mike. Uh. A jingle that makes your product more memorable. You hear them on TV and radio. Mm. Well, sure. Those catchy tunes do get stuck in my head all the time. But how will I put my theme song out there? I don't have the money for advertising. Just sing it here all day long! Hmm? Nani ga nani? I can't do that. You said you'd be willing to try anything, right? At least see how it goes! Uh, I don't have a song to sing. And I'm a terrible singer, mate. Hmm, you need something light and catchy to get rid of your shady image. How about this? How about you get the fuck out of the dark alleys? Whisper, 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 whisper. Okay, now give it a try. Okay, this is Kiryu acting as a ghostwriter for Kitajima the Shroomer. This is his first, first song published on air. Let's get it. Oh, you got me fucked up. You think I'm singing? No, son, no, son, no, son, no, son. <laughs> Not bad at all. The lyrics work well if I do say so myself. Hmm. What do you think? Uh. Hey, nobody would mistake you for a hallucinogenic mushroom dealer singing that song. No, they would think that you were on your own shit. Well, now that you mention it, yeah? I think you're right. Okay, I'll give the singing a try, yeah? Thanks, Curious One. <laughs> ha, good luck. Thumbs up. I'm out of here. You don't have to sing to me. Oh, where the fuck are you going now? <laughs> Seems like he's taking the shine to that theme song. I'll just do this again. How many? What? What is this? It's Buna Shimeji, mate. Uh... Buna what? That's not the mushroom we want. S sorry. You may have gotten the wrong idea, Mike, but we only sell regular mushrooms, eh? Huh? Give me the shrooms! Uh... Mm. That's Kitajima the Shroomer, again. I came a long way because I heard you had quality shrooms. What gives? Well, our uh, mushrooms are of finest quality, but they're just mushrooms, Mike, with no special properties. Mm. It's no use. He doesn't understand. What am I going to do? Oh, I know. Y 
You're dead. All right. Oi. What? You. How do we get this guy to cough up the good stuff? He's just a regular mushroom seller. If you want the other kind of mushroom, try somewhere else. We all know this is not going to work, so just put your fucking fists up and let's get it done. It's too late for talk! We can't back down now! No, it's perfectly plausible for you to back down now. It's acceptable. We can do- we don't have to do this! Too bad. You're obstructing his business, so I'm going to have to ask you to leave before I remove you myself. <laughs> Uh, you will regret this. Kill him! Uh, camera? Okay, how many? I am surrounded. That's a gun. That is a gun! That's a gun! Well, Smith got his shit pushed in for sure. Wait, that's another gun. What the fuck are you doing? Get that work, Arakawa! I got stabbed again! Don't tease me, bro. Ah! This motherfucker right there. Oh, Ishi, is that your name? No, Okano. You're getting hella fucking old, man. Ah! Thanks for helping me again, Kiryu-san. <sighs> Looks like they thought you were selling hallucinogenic mushrooms again, huh? <sighs> yeah, I guess the theme song really didn't help, huh? What's it going to take? I just want people to know, I got the tastiest mushrooms in Japan, mate. What? Wait, the tastiest mushrooms in Japan? Hey, let me try one. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, sure. Ah, buono, delicious. <laughs> what is this mushroom? Mm. Oh, it's just one of my mushrooms, mate. This is Kitajima's mushrooms. It tastes fantastic. How do you grow them? Oh, thank you, thank you. I have my own special technique. That mushroom reminded me of the old days in Nap Naples. I used to be a chef there many, many years ago. We used to watch Maradona just go apeshit on the pitch and just eat some shrooms, you know. Oh, it was amazing. Oh, you were chef. I was well known in Naples back then. I worked every day trying to make the best pasta in all of Europe. I perfected the ideal al dente pasta. Uh... The problem was the sauce. I could never find mushrooms worthy of my pasta. I visited mushroom sellers every day, searching for a mushroom to match my pasta. None were good enough. I never found the right mushroom. My restaurant was losing money and my girl left me. That motherfucking escalated quickly. I grew to hate pasta. <laughs> As you do. I gave up and took over the family business. The mafia. I see. You want some more enokis, mate? But I've finally found it! The ideal mushroom to go with my pasta. I should be able to make the finest pasta in Europe now. Kitajima, 
would you come back to Italy with me? We will take Europe by storm with the best mushroom pasta ever! Hmm? Nani ga nani? This is all so sudden! Who's gonna take over this dark alley after me? But if I went to Europe with you, I bet I could get lots of people to try my mushrooms. Curious son, I... I don't really know what to think, but don't worry about me. <laughs> you need to listen to what your heart tells you. Hey. Hmm, yeah, okay. I'll go with you if it means that I can show more people how good my mushrooms are. <laughs> Grazie molto bene. Thank you, Kitajima. I'm still I'm a little bit worried, you know. I think my mushrooms are the best in Japan, but I don't know if people will like them overseas. <laughs> ha! Show some confidence. Remember what you always say? Huh? Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. We, we are friends now. Get out of here. Okay, and I think that's gonna have to be it for this episode. I hope you all enjoyed the episode. This has been your boy Karagol Gaming. I am out.